Hello friends, in this video we will discuss how we can create a survey in SharePoint 2016 online. To create a survey list, first go to settings, then select site contents. Then click on add an app. Search survey. You will find a survey list. Click on it. Give an appropriate name to your survey list. To all survey. Click on create. Our survey list is created successfully. Now we will add some question in our survey list. Just click on survey list from setting. Click add questions. Type your question here. Do you like this channel? I will provide a choice option for this question. So I will enter two choices yes or no. Require a response to the question means this question is mandatory or not. So I will click here no. By default set the unique values. Now click next question to add some another question so now I will add another question enter your number to join learn to all yes, the group so I will apply here single line or text. Okay. Now I want to mark this question as a compulsory question, so I will write here required. Then just click to next question. To you want to subscribe a channel so I will apply some choices I will make it as required I will apply your drop down menu or a check boxes so they can apply multiple values yes no maybe later clear now click on the next question I will add one of the last question please provide your suggestions I will write here multiple line of text just click on finish so uh, by this way we can create a survey list and add all the questions to our survey list now I want to respond to a survey list for that what I have to do is first I will go to a survey list click on respond to the survey so I can do like this channel yes enter your number to join whatsapp group so I will add it is compulsory so it will automatically add as to it. it is a compulsory question so it will add automatically as to the question so I will add plus nine one nine five three seven nine eight one four six seven so this is the number you can also join learn to whatsapp group by requesting on this number 
uh, it's a real one. So you can send your request to this one. Uh, then do you like to subscribe this channel? Yes. Uh, provide your solution. Very good. Now I will respond to this survey. So click on finish. So my survey is responded to server. So now uh, as an admin user I want to see uh, who has responded to the survey. So I will click show all the responses. So I will view the first response. So this is how one can respond to a server. Now another thing. Um, I am logging uh, to SharePoint site as a provincial and I already respond to this survey. So if I will again respond to this survey, it will show this error. You are not allowed to respond again to this survey. So how to solve this error? To solve this kind of error, first go to your server list, then click on settings. Server setting, list name, description, and navigation. Now, here is an option allow multiple responses. Select yes, click save. Now, if I will again respond to the same survey, it will not show the error. Now, let's go to the survey list. Now I will click on respond to this survey. So it will allow me to respond to this survey again. So by this way uh, you can create a survey list, add your question, respond to your survey and allow multiple responses to your survey list. So if you have any doubt related to this video you can mail me at provincia16 at gmail.com you can also WhatsApp me on plus nine one nine five three seven nine eight one four six seven. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.